Yo, Knights of Apollo, what is up guys? Hope you're doing well and welcome back to Banner Lord. This is episode 9 and uh, this is the last episode that I recorded uh, many in a day, if you get what I'm saying. So I recorded three episodes today. So we are doing a likes challenge. So if every thousand likes, the, the next episode, within, within 24 hours... Every thousand likes is an is an hour for the next episode. So if this episode here gets to two thousand likes, the 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 next episode corresponding to this one will be two hours long. Now, of course, we started this challenge like three episodes ago. It's just that I recorded these all in one sitting because I'm going out of town. So once I get back, then the whole like challenge will go into play. We'll see. I don't know. Again, the episode seven was recorded today so i don't know what that's going to be at in 24 hours but it's going to be fun to see where you take it and i promise you in the future we will have the appropriate long episodes so let's jump in guys by the way like the video of course it's the the challenge is still going on every thousand likes equals an hour so i think that's going to be pretty fun anyways uh we're back where we left off in this great camp campaign of Brennan in Veth. Uh, we have just defeated the, I, I, can we call it a defeat? I don't know if we can, but we technically won a war against the Northern empire. It wasn't a huge strategic war because we didn't gain anything of value honestly um we we gained this castle but unfortunately they took it back and as soon as they took it back they negotiated peace in our terms well you know that is one thing we want we're i think we're gaining like a thousand gold per day or whatever in tribute from them so it it's something right it's something we're still a very weak kingdom uh, the Valandians look, I mean, just the way their territory is laid out now looks like they're about to inhale us, like swallow us whole here. So Valandia is going to be a problem. We're currently paying them 5,000 tribute, uh, which usually means we should go to war against them pretty soon, but oof, it is not going to be an easy war and we need to continue to, uh, strengthen our army. To prepare for said war so well i i don't really know how to do that i i mean it's there's a tournament over here i guess we could play a tournament i think what we need to do is continue to improve the equipment of our companions continue to get more companions you know it's been nice we've we found our surgeon we got our doctor we got our epic warrior commander type commander or companion and then we also have our um, strategic, our um, scholar uh, companion, which is he's going to be more focused on the, the engineering of like sieges and defenses and stuff. So um, I guess we could try to find like a scout companion. Oh, whoa, 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 whoa. let's slow this down. Oh, hey, 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 hey. Oh, this guy just straight up ignored me. What the heck? He's like, screw the archer. I don't care. And notice too, guys, there was a little bit of lag there. But notice too, remember, like, I had to turn off. Oof, that guy just got wrecked. I had to turn off the, um, the disembodiment, whatever mod that where you can chop off limbs and stuff. It's a really cool mod, but unfortunately, I think it's, it's not stable right now. That was close. So, um, I obviously would rather be able to play and not constantly worry about crashing. Man, this guy's blocking like crazy. Yeah, don't try to faint the AI. I just don't think it's going to... Okay. Wow. <laughs> that guy was... A, dude, he went off. It's all right. We still got to the next round. Is he on my team? No. Oh, that'd be awesome. I'd love to have him on my team. But yeah, he went off there. Yeah. 
All right, there we go. All right, we just made it to the next round. And look who it is. It's the guy that went off. He's he's behind this guy. We're not going to win this. Or maybe we will? Oh, my God. Oh, my God. I bet we could have blocked that. They both attacked from the same direction. I bet we could have blocked that. That's okay. We made it to the next round. It's a 2v2 again. This is my third time facing this Mengus guy. Let's see if we can beat him here. Uh, I don't like it when it's 2v2 and we both have big weapons. I like it when there's one with... Oh, nice. That's a good start. There we go. We pulled it off. Very good start there. We're getting a horse here too, which is nice. All right. We're going to face our Batanian skirmisher here. He's been our teammate for a while. All right. Pretty easy. Cool. Cool. We'll take that. It's not much. I mean, we have a lot of money. This 800 gold is like nothing for us now, but I just figured we could do it to earn some renown. We got six renown. I mean, six renowns for, for tournaments is actually really good. So I know tournaments are kind of at this stage have kind of gotten stale a little bit, but we kind of still need to do them because it's going to help us level up, right? Because it's, it's renown that improves your rank right yeah yeah so during peacetime i'm probably gonna look at tournaments not for money not for the prizes but for the renown so we did level up our two-handed which is that's all that's the other thing we do improve our skills when we play in tournaments so baptize in blood plus five plus five experience to infantry in your party for each enemy you kill with a two wow that's pretty cool show of strength plus 30 percent chance of knocking the enemy down with a heavy hit uh, i'm gonna go with the experience anytime to any any way that we can improve the experience of our army is is definitely worth it in, in my opinion we could also at this point do quest uh to improve the relations with lords which is never a terrible idea because the more we do that, the more villages are going to like us. And that's going to make it so if we desperately need to get new recruits, they're going to have high level recruits that we can quickly, you know, hire. Doesn't need much training. Uh, do we, oh, do we level up again? Or is this someone else? I think this is someone else. Oh, yes. This is our, our epic warrior. So his scouting went up. This doesn't really help us at all. But, uh, whatever. I don't, why is his scouting going up? I, I, I have no... I guess I have him down as a scout. I don't know. Um, the other thing... I wanted to check, because we probably do need to get a wife here soon. I, I'm kind of... I kind of want to marry the daughter of the king of the Volandians, because I think that would just be so funny. Just to like, you know, make her fall in love with, with me. Um, so Lord and Lady. Um, so let's just look for it's in alphabetical order. So Dirth what is it? Dirth yeah, Dirthurt or whatever. So does he have a daughter? Yes, he does. Relation is minus one. I oh how how old is she? I don't know. She's in Sargot. Let me just, let me just, let me just go. Uh, okay, let's do the tournament here. But after the tournament, let's go talk to her. Let's just, let's just, let's just see what she's all about. So we got a 2v2 going on here for the tournament. We are fighting for a helmet. I don't think this helmet's better than any of the helmets we have. And I'm also talking about companions as well. I would like to, now that we've got our companions in the army kind of decked out with some decent armor they, they don't have the best armor or anything but we we should start to focus on the caravan companions even though they should avoid fighting it might help to give them some some armor you know all right so now we got a big team battle i do not like these at all i do like the fact that we got a a, a shield though Hey, look, my companion's on my side. Oh, this is going well. Nice job. Come on, bro. You can't go out like that. 
All right, so... Oh, nice. Okay. All right, so a 1v1 here against Britannian Falksman. Got to be careful. He's pretty good. Like, if he lands a hit, they're pretty good soldiers, so... That's all right. We won. Let's see who wins this. Yeah! All right, win-win right here. If we lose, if we win, don't, don't matter. Look at him go, man. Look at him go. Nice. Good job. All right, so what do we get out of the... Oh, yeah, the helmet. And let's not forget the three or six renown that we get for this tournament. Again, tournaments are kind of like... They're boring. They're tedious. They they're easy to win now. Now that our 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 guy is pretty leveled up, he's got some better armor. He's harder to kill. But again, that renown really does help out. Let's see if this helmet um, brings any value to any of the soldiers we have here. So it is not a sheep. I don't know why. There we go. So it gives us twenty six head armor. 26 head armor so don't it is better than i just like him wearing the wolf or the bear stuff i like that so i don't want to change that all right what about you no everybody has better helmets well i could always just sell it i'll just hold on to it i'll just hold on to it so let's go to sargot and see our romantic chances of speaking to uh this lady here Oh, it'd be so funny to get her on our side. So funny. It's just, it would just be so perfect because it's like taking it, you know, taking his precious little daughter and just being, you know, deflowered by a, by a Batanian friggin' berserker. <laughs> All right. Anyways, let's go to the keep. Oh, we got a brighter way in. There she is. She's not a looker not a look or maybe it's just a bad photo let's go talk to her Peace to you, yeah you know I, i'm not doing this for love so i'm doing this for to send a message um uh i do not know whether to find that charming or oh my gosh okay we meet from time to time as the custom see if we are right for each other hope to see you again yeah, uh, okay, so let's just fight in this tournament. Maybe we can impress her by winning the tournament, and we'll go from there. You know, it'd be kind of cool if you had, like, a natural rivalry with another faction. You know, kind of like us and the Sturgeons. We're always going to war, and the crowd boos you. You know what I mean? When you win, when you enter the uh, the arena, they boo you because you're Batanian. I think that would be so sick. Okay. Got some lag right when that guy was swinging. I was I was gonna be pretty upset there. All right, one v one v one. What do we got? Some check here. The sword sister. Sword sister. See you later. All right, we got a Valandian hardened crossbow. I I don't like this because he's gonna be my teammate in the next round. So, let's see what we're facing. We're taking on a... Vin okay, that's... that's Wow, this is a crappy pool of, of soldiers here that have made it this far. Oh my gosh. I should... Oh, nice, dude. Nice. Let's see if we can defeat this guy. I don't think so. Alright. I wanted to get a couple hits there so I can improve my crossbow a little bit. That's okay. Alright. Ooh. Horse. I get it. Oh! That's not good. Oh, I just did 96 damage. This guy's toast. Oh, not if I miss like that. There we go. Sweet. We won. We can impress the lady. We also have an interesting helmet. I don't know if that helmet's better than what we currently have. But 
We'll give it a try. We'll give it a look. I could always give it to my future wife. Uh, see if she wants the helmet. <laughs> Dude, I hope we I hope we woo her. I really do. I hope we uh we earn her love. Cause that would be so funny. Alright, let's let's go talk to her again. Brennan. Um I'm glad we get a chance to spend some time together. Yeah, it's good to have, yeah. Alright, so we want to do stuff. This is a hundred percent, so yeah, I, I can't imagine that failing. Oh, these are all pretty good. Okay. I'm getting nervous. I'm getting nervous. Oh, this is 100%. Okay. Wow. Those are some good... See, we have to... Seems we have a fair amount in common. Uh, perhaps we can talk more when we meet again. Okay, so I think we got to give it like a day or something. So, I'm going to... <laughs> That was super easy. Usually it's a little harder than that, but that was the first wave. The second try is a, li a little bit more complicated. Um, ooh, there's 29 looters. This was, this is going to give us great chance to get some experience for the army. All right. Surrender or die. And in the troops, we lost one troop, which is unfortunate. And I don't want any of those prisoners. I'll take the loot, though. Actually, wait. Yes, we'll let the troops have this loot. There's nothing good in here, so let them have the troops. Yes. All right, so we gave them the loot. And look at that. Nine troops are ready for upgrade. Wow, we wow. That's awesome. That's, that's going to help so much. Anyways, let's go to this city. I think there was a tournament over here, no? Yep, there, there is. So we can do another tournament. Um, we'll spend some time here. See, we got there just in time. And uh, again, winning this is going to get us six renown, which is nice. It adds up. It really does. Um, but this is just giving us something to do as we kill some time. I don't know how long you have to wait until you can talk again to, the, to your um, love. love I think it's just maybe a day. You know, like, you're a total weirdo creep. Oh, look, it's my companion. We're fighting together. Total weirdo creep. Like, okay. You know, when you first talk to her, it's like, well, we should see if we have anything in common. But I'll talk to you later. It's like you walk out of her door. You walk back in. You want to hang out? Like, okay. You know? <laughs> like, it doesn't take much time. There you go. Cool. All right, and it's gonna be me versus my companion, which kind of sucks. Oh, I don't, I don't, I do not like this. One small mistake, and it could be the death of you. There you go. All right, we can bet again. Betting doesn't really do much for us here because we're highly ranked. Everyone expects us to win. Got a cool knight here, though. Ooh. There we go. And let's get this finale in and get our six renown. Ooh, 68 damage. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Oh. Damn you and your blocking. Oh, nice. He's going to go in slow here. Damn it. There we go. You dummy. You dummy trying to hit me. Nice. Tournament is over. Another victory. We're really getting our renown up there. Six renown. It's so nice to have that perk. We got that perk. I forgot it was called, but... Originally, like, bef without the perk, you only get three renown. But now we get six, which really snowballs with these tournaments. So what we'll do is let's first check out. Let's check out what we got. Um, we got this helmet. I totally forgot about this. 26. Yeah, it's better than that. Um, Yeah, 26 is not that great. What about the sword? The sword is a little bit better than what uh, the engineer has. Let's see our main warrior, though. He should have first dibs. He doesn't even have a sword. He has... 
A one-handed axe. He's okay. So we'll pa we'll give it to to him. It's a little bit better than what he currently has. What about the 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 healer? What's your sword? Oh, this is definitely better. Okay, cool. We got some upgrading there. Can't complain there, guys. Cannot complain. All right, so we've got our tournaments in. Let's go back to Sargot. It might be a little too early, so I think I'm going to go to Sargot and just chill for a day. Oh, we got some looters. We got some looters. More experience for us. You can't outrun me in the forest. Don't you understand? The forest is not your friend. I was born in the forest. I was born in it. Nice. We didn't lose anybody. And, yep, we'll give it, give it to the troops. And uh, let's see if anybody leveled up. Yeah, five. Look at that. Like, we're getting a ton of leveling up for, uh, for troops. For, like, easy looter battles. That's so good. Giving your troops your equipment for extra XP is just so good. All right, let's go see if we can go to the keep and we can talk to her. Peace to you. Yeah, peace to you. <laughs> All right, we should perhaps discuss our future together. Well, I've been thinking, okay. Oh, boy. Okay, okay, come on. Come on, baby. Yes! 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 <laughs> Hell yes! We just cucked his stupid king. We took his daughter. Sexual conquest. <laughs> That's so funny. That was so easy. I don't know why that was so easy. Is she like, is she, is she kind of suck? No, she's actually, she'd make for a good caravan. She's okay. She doesn't have any fighting skill, but a good trade and charm. That's weird. You think someone with good charm, it would be hard to charm. You know, you know what I mean? All right, let's find her daddy. I can't wait for this conversation. He probably just doesn't care. He's like, well, whatever. That's one less problem I got to deal with, you know? Uh, I was just upset to have a daughter, you know? Like, I wanted all boys. You know? No, it's good to have a daughter. I mean, it, medieval speaking, you can use your daughter's politically i mean that's i know that's messed up but like that's just how it was you know that's just how it was back then you know what i mean don't get mad at me i'm just i'm just saying from a medieval mindset okay that having a daughter is uh there's some political benefit to that you know that's all i'm saying that's all i'm saying that's all i'm saying all right let's see where he is now because i don't think he's yeah he's he's changed locations he's roaming around somewhere what is this oh okay another like little city state is gone okay so he's up this way Let's see if we can talk to him real quick before the tournament ah, i can imagine he's still over there yeah what is he doing over here is he recruiting i don't see him <sighs> okay it He's probably in here. Is this him? Yeah. Yep. 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 He's in here. All right. Let's go to the keep. We got to bribe our way in. Go talk to him. Whoa. They updated the leaders of the factions. That's cool. Peace to you, brother. I'm not even going to be nice to him. Here. You know, you know me as Brennan. Mark it down. You shall be hearing a lot of me. <laughs> just be rude as hell to him i'm here to discuss with terms of the marriage very well then yeah dude why is it so cheap he does not care about this man i don't know whatever that's fine here it is yeah <laughs> we just took his daughter we just took his daughter she's gonna hate me though I don't, this was amazingly easy. Like, if she had minus one relation with us, I thought for sure this was going to be tough. I mean, it's the princess of Valandia. And she just, she just married some backwater dummy. That's like, that's, <laughs> Brennan is some nobody. He's some lowly lord. Look at, look at these, look at these idiots. 
Who's this? Is that the king of uh of Britannia or Britannia? Look at him. You get you suckers got to stand together. Ah uh ha! -huh. Idiot. All right, cool. Congratulations, you. The heavens bless you. Okay, well. Sweet. Uh, let's go get her in the party so we can start making babies. Making babies, baby. All right, so if we go to our clan, here she is. Join us. Yes. Cool, so she could lead her own army, um, which I'm probably what I'm going to do. First, we're going to have some babies, though, because she could die in battle. But she needs to churn out at least two or three babies, and then I'll be happy about that. Principality, okay. I thought we already got this notification. All right, that was amazingly easy. We did this so fast. I thought this was going to be like at least the full episode. We're only like halfway through this episode, and that was uh, that was pretty easy. <laughs> That's funny. There she is. All right, she's with the party. So I I need a I what I need next is a castle. That's that's basically I want Inveth back. My own home city has been under under freaking Valandian rule. Which really sucks. There's a hideout we could go after. Eh. I don't feel like it. Hopefully we got war here soon. And hopefully it's the Valandians. I'm gonna impregnate this Valandian whore okay. She's my wife. Valandian wife. Get her pregnant, then throw her in a jail cell. <laughs> no, I'm just, I'm just kidding. I'm just, I'm just joshing around. I'm just joking. Uh, there's a tournament over here. We could do that. You know? Yeah, it sucks. It sucks. Peacetime kind of sucks. Especially, like, I was kind of counting on the whole marriage proposal thing to be a little bit more challenging. I didn't expect it to be so easy. I honestly thought I was going to get rejected, but that was so dummy easy. Maybe it's because she's not that great of a pickup. You know what I mean? Like maybe that she's just easy to, to wed because she's, I mean, she's really not that great of an addition. Addition, addition, addition. Oh, okay. Calm down there, buddy. Calm down. Look at this guy. All right, cool. That was uh, that was some intense battles, actually. I wonder if my wife is in here. No, she's not really a warrior kind of chick. You know what I mean? She's she's more of just like the baby making variety. Okay, cool. And now we got a two v two. Don't like that. Let's see if one has a boat. No, we both have swords. Okay, don't like this. I don't like how slow I am. Okay, I like that we nice dude. Look at us. Look at us. Look at us. Look at us. Beating our respected opponents. Now it's time for me and you. Let's battle. You're dead. A lot of misses. There we go. That was easy. Okay, cool. What do we earn? Uh some sword. All right, plus six renown. That's all that that matters. Now I'm gonna look at my uh, uh what my wife has for uh or Brennan's wife. You get what I'm saying? What she has for armor, and and see if we can take any of it. It'd be kind of cool if like you win a tournament and it increases your fertility or something. <laughs> I don't I don't know. <laughs> like she, your wife's like, oh wow, look at you winning that tournament. I'm so. You know what you, you get what I'm saying. All right. Um, let's see. What is, where is she? Is, she must be down here. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. She's she doesn't, she doesn't really give off the warrior princess vibe, but yeah, she's got some good equipment. Good for her. Good for her. Cause eventually we're going to send her out and maybe, maybe we should chill inside a, a city. You know, that way we can actually shack up or whatever. Oh, there's another tournament over here. Ah, oh, I shouldn't. I shouldn't. Oh, I should. We're so close to getting the next tier. 
Yeah, we're going to play in the tournament. I know, guys. I'm pro I'm sorry. This might be kind of boring for you, but I, it's important. All right. So, 2v2. I'm taking on my companion. Doesn't look like my wife is competing. That's nice. Okay, that's rude. I'm going to go in and just join the fight. Oh, my goodness. I couldn't even get there in time. All right, bro. Put the put the freaking bow down and take the sword out. That's right. How dare you cross blades with me? How dare you? 2v2. Uh, don't like this. Nice. Oh. Calm down. Calm down. Alright, another 2v2. Let's see if one of us is an archer. Nope. Both with the sword. These are better fighters. Look at you go, bro. Look at us. Look at us. Taking down a respected I'm having deja vu. Alright, now it's a 1v1. And he's gonna be crushed. Gosh. Yeah, it's nice. It's nice to have a better, like, compared to earlier fights, got better armor. I, my guy can take punches a little bit better. And there we go. That's nice. So, we haven't leveled up here for the clan tier. We will level up once we win the next tournament. So, I might look for one more tournament just to get us over the hump. And we're going to be tier clan three. That is a huge upgrade that's a huge promotion that's gonna have it so we can have even more troops oh no we we just did it okay never mind oh well we can have two more troops a whole whopping two more troops okay well we're gonna wait here for some time and you know you know what me what you know what brennan's doing with this new valandian woman daughter of dirthurt <laughs> Oh, that's so funny. Watch it like mend our uh, our relation, you know. Watch like, oh, we don't want to attack him. We got our we got a marriage between the two kingdoms. Like, there's no more room for war. All right, our steward went up. That's nice. The wounded troops in your party are no longer paid wages. Oof. That's kind of messed up. That seems wrong. The plus 25 influence gain from donating troops. Uh, we'll do that. <laughs> we'll cheat people. Oh, you're wounded? Mm, looks like you're, we're going to have to hold your wages. Sorry, buddy. What? Yeah. I just put my life on the line for you. Well, you're not really doing much other than laying there. So I don't think it's fair for me to pay you. What? <laughs> Oh, she's with child. That was so easy, guys. Ellis. Is it Ellis or Ellie? I don't know. She's pregnant. I don't even know how to say her name. She's pregnant. Okay, cool. So she's going to have a future. Uh, oh, we can have 142 now? What? Is it because we leveled up steward? Brother. That is epic. That is epic. Now, here's the thing, guys. Here's the thing. I bet we could have even more troops if we put my wife as the quartermaster. Because her steward is... It's it's at 135. What are we at? No. Not what I'm trying to do. Um, I am... 150 okay no i'm better okay i forgot it's been you know my my character's been leveling up in skill all right so we can we can get a lot of troops now so let's um let's get a combination let's just keep doing the combination of sturgeon troops and batanian archers and that is going to be our deadly combo so uh let's go over here this is Connected to a castle, right? Yes. So, yeah, we'll get some archers. Hell yeah. Hell yeah. We're going to have a sick, nasty army, guys. Sick, nasty. 
Uh, but they're going to need some leveling up, though. So hopefully... Uh, there's not really anything there. I really don't want the Batanian infantry. I I'm just not impressed. Not impressed with them. Let's go over this way. This should have some uh, some archers in the village for recruitment. This is so sweet, though. Like, this is awesome. How are we doing financially? We're making negative money, which is okay. We It's only 500 a day. We got 1,000. Or, oh, we got 109,000. All right, let's... Nope, 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 nope. That's, we want to recruit troops. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. That's what I'm talking about. We'll go ahead and recruit from here. And then the rest of the remaining space of recruitment. Well, oh, beautiful. We'll fill, we'll fill it up with Sturgeon troops. So let's just um, quickly go over here to the Sturgeon, the Sturgeon territory. Even though it's controlled by the Northern Empire, it still, it still has its cultural identity here of Sturgeon troops. We're going to train them to be mighty warriors look at that 142 troops wow guys we're doing it we're doing it this is great i'm ready for war though i'm ready to do some more risque battles you know outnumbered by a ton but we just got like a god tier army all right cool let's go up here look at that we're gonna we're gonna max out here. We need two more troops. Almost took hostile action there. That would be bad. Okay, there we go. We're maxed out. I'm ready. Come on. Let's do something. It's like that meme. The guy poking the thing with a stick, and it's like, do something. That's me right now. I'm ready. I'm so ready. Make it the Vlandians. I don't care. I don't give a damn. Um, hideout? Uh, let's go clear the hideout. It's something to do. It's something to do. We have a contract with, with mercenaries to come fight for us. But we're not at war, so I don't know why. Or maybe since we hired some mercenaries, we're going to attack soon. Um... Sure. We'll do this. Okay. Yeah, I could have brought my uh, companions with me. That would be pretty interesting to charge in with a bunch of companions, but that's okay. We don't need to do that. All right, so we're going to tell them to fire at will. Everyone, fire! And I'm going to tell them to... Uh, well, actually, do what you're doing. Nice. Good job. All right. Everyone after me. Move on to the next stage. That was pretty cool. It's always nice. Just spawn in and just fire away. <laughs> you don't have to you don't even have to move forward. Alright. So forward! Forward! Move! Archers. Everyone move! Kind of acting weird. Not going in the right place. Okay, my archers are quick. Why do they do that? I guess they can't go up there. What? That's weird. It's like I tell them to go here. They don't. Ow. What the hell was that from? Where, who's shooting arrows? Whoa. Oh, it's straight ahead. Jerk. Every forward. Yeah, screw this arrow stuff. Come fight me. Get this guy. Nice. Alright, you know what? Everyone. Let's charge. Let's just finish this. Just finish this mess. And uh, the nice thing is that we'll get a bunch of loot. Oh, what a shot. What a freaking shot. We'll get a bunch of loot and we can give that to the soldiers to level up. Yeah, 
Eat, eat arrows. You trash. All right, here we go. Woo. I might challenge him to a duel. Then I can take all those guys prisoner. Yeah, we'll challenge him. Very well. Ooh. All right, everybody deserves a spit. <laughs> now tie yourself up. You're you're prisoners now. Let's go. All right, yeah. So we gained ten prisoners. That's awesome. They're really good. Those are good prisoners too. Like those are good guys to have in the army. Um, bunch of troops leveled up. And we're going to have all this loot, which I'm going to give to the army. Yeah, there's nothing here that we can... I'll take the food, though. I, I don't think they can take the food anyways. Yeah. So we'll take the food. We'll let, let them have everything else. And we improved our relation with nearby notables. Notables? I don't know. That's a funny word. Oh, the, the notables. The ones that we take note of are very happy of you getting rid of that hideout. Um, let's check our upgrades again after giving them, yep, that's perfect. Giving them experience. Perfect. And we're just getting stronger and stronger, guys. Stronger and stronger. So the nice thing about the political diplomacy mod or whatever it's called, the, the diplomacy mod, bat wars are not, what is this? Oh, someone broke off. Someone broke off to... Where are they? Huh. Yeah, did you see that notification? Oh, I, I don't see... I don't see it, but... It said someone broke off from the Southern Empire to form their own... Their own state. Um... There we are. Uh, so yeah, we're, um... Whoa! Rebels! Really? Is... Where is this? Who's rebelling? They don't even have any territory. So does that mean we're at war? Uh, I... Uh, okay. Um... What? Like, hold on. Are they, are they on here? Okay. Maybe they haven't left yet. Maybe it's just like, it might happen soon. Um, well, that's fine. If they, if they do break apart here soon, it's something for me to fight. I need to get more caravans going. I wonder if I can get my wife as a caravan. I was, would that be messed up to make my wife a caravan person? I mean, at least she's not fighting. But I kind of would want her to be a fighter. You know, lead her own army. But we are kind of hurting with, like, uh, money. I mean, losing a thousand per day, that's, that's, a, that's a good amount. I don't know. I don't know what to do at this point. I, we're just kind of waiting for war. We're waiting for war. You know what? I, I think I'll just call it an episode here. Here, we'll we'll compete in this tournament, and then we'll call it an episode. I know it's going to be a little bit on the shorter side, but this is my third episode that I've recorded today, and I got to get some stuff done before I go out of town. So let's just compete in this tournament. We'll end it on a good note, end it with some action, and uh, yeah. Big team battle. Let's do it. Who's on my team? Oh, a bunch of a bunch of freaking people. Oh, they've got a bunch of people too. I'm going in. Nice. That's how you do it. Yeah, that's really the key. If you spawn in as the archer, just go in. 
Extra sword in the front line. That's how that's how you do it. Ooh, banner of steel shields. Decrease taken shield damage. That's cool. Uh I kinda wanna win this. We actually get something cool here. Alright, bro, let's go. You and me. You got no chance against me. No chance. All right. Same thing to you, bucko. Clean your room. You got no chance. All right. Hey, it's me versus Mengus. Remember Mengus? I, I don't remember. Do we face him in this episode or was it a previous episode? I, I've done so many episodes today. Okay. We got to focus here. This guy's a swinger. He's a swinger. Oh my god, he's he's good, dude. What the hell? He was blocking everything. Oh, that's all right. <laughs> oh well. You win some, you lose some. That's just how it goes. Uh that banner wasn't that cool. It's fine. I'm just coping. Uh but yeah, that's going to wrap it up for today's episode. We kept it a little bit on the shorter side, but it is uh, one in the morning and I got to do laundry and do some homework and stuff. But thank you guys so much for watching. Hope you enjoyed this one. This was uh, this was a lot of fun. It wasn't a lot in terms of battles. In, in fact, I don't think we had any battles, but we got hitched to the daughter of the Valandians. Let's go. Let's go. That's really funny. Anyways, guys, thank you so much for watching. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. That means a lot to me. Hope you guys enjoyed, and I'll see you next time in Cal Radio.